Keto Marnie here. It is Thursday morning and that is the sound of the Keurig. Got my coffee brewing. Um, so I've got a small, very small little grocery haul again today. I went back to Schnucks to get the egg wraps that I forgot yesterday. I wanted to get them before they went off sale. I didn't even look at what the regular price is supposed to be, but I was okay with the price of them now. They're for, uh, $3.99. So, uh, I also wanted to answer a viewer question. Gloria asked, uh, why I have been eating sardines if I don't like them. I'm learning to like them. I'm, I'm getting better at learning to like them. <laughs> I want to get to a point where I don't think twice about it. Because they are a, basically a nutrient-dense powerhouse. They're packed with lots of vitamins and minerals and uh, also iodine, which I don't use iodized salt. I use pink salt and there's no iodine in that. Uh, so any iodine that I get, I get from food, which uh, there is iodine in uh, sardines. I believe it's probably in tuna also. Uh, and I think it's also in dairy. According to Thomas DeLauer, it is also in dairy. Uh, coffee is done <laughs> just a second so today I've got the uh, I'm just doing the just a second. the uh, great value extra calf black and so I will show you what I got uh, I got some clearance items uh, but mainly what I went there for was these I got two packages of the southwest ones because these are the ones I really like um, lesson learned, I will not wrap the, I will not wrap these around the bratwurst and then cook them more. That doesn't work, especially since I refrigerate them, because once I refrigerated them, they became real tough and chewy. Um, I'll just wrap them as is, they stay soft, pliable. Uh, but I still like them wrapped around the brats, that's the way I'll do it, I just won't cook it that way. Um... And I, I did get a package of brats. Uh, I just left them upstairs. Um, so I got two packages of these. Uh, let's see. These were on clearance for $1.29. The uh, chocolate hazelnut. So I got five of them. Um, since, my, uh, since I used my Philadelphia cream cheese, I bought a rate bait yesterday it's probably not going to be back on for a couple more days uh so i got this this was two dollars and 19 cents and it is only one gram um because i do want to make more of the egg loaf without the coconut flour um this was a clearance item it was three dollars so there's uh uh flax and hemp seeds so that this was also um, a clearance item. This was two dollars and ninety-eight cents. I don't use a lot of flax seed, but I do like to use it on occasion. I keep it in the freezer to keep it fresh. Uh, I got some more lemon juice, even though I've got plenty upstairs. This is to keep down here, and this is for the sardines and. Uh, the tuna that isn't flavored. It's not for the tuna infusions. This is for the regular yellowfin tuna and the albacore tuna. I got four of the two good yogurts. They were on sale. Four for five dollars at Schnucks. Uh, and then last Come, brings me to the sardines so there was still a bunch of them on clearance and there still are a bunch on clearance uh, so I got the last of this particular one this is the Mediterranean style uh, with black olives and olive oil uh, these were $1.99 so I got eight of them that's what was left uh, the ones that I had Last night were the regular ones. They were just uh, not the Mediterranean style. 
uh, but they were by Bumblebee, and, and they were okay. I smothered them in mustard, uh, and uh, I liked them okay. Uh, they had a bunch of those also. No, wait, I take that back. These were $1.69. The regular ones were $1.99, so I got these. But the uh, Mediterranean style with the black olives, that sounded better to me anyway. And I got eight of those, and then I also got two of these. These were $1.19 on clearance, and they're just uh, packed in water with sea salt. So I will smother them with mustard. I didn't buy this today. I got this at Walmart a couple days ago, a few days ago. Uh, so anyway, that's going to do it for my small little haul. Uh... I don't have anything really. I'm not doing anything too awful spectacular. I do want to do the egg loaf again, but I am going to do it in chuffle style and I'm going to be using the Holsteins to make them because I they're sweet. Since uh, they're going to be a sweet chuffle and kind of desserty like, I want them be to be like a Belgian waffles. So that's why I'm going to use the Holsteins. Uh, I would use uh, I would use my my big Belgian waffle maker, but I used sausage on it last time. I don't know if I really. I mean, not that it would be bad, but I would prefer that my egg loaf not taste like sausage. Although, again, it wouldn't be bad at all. In fact, I would probably be inclined to put sausage with it along with bacon and pour syrup all over that. Anyway. <laughs> I'm going to go, uh, I'm going to drink my coffee, probably pay, play my game for a little bit while I'm waiting for my cream cheese and eggs to come to room temperature, and I will check back in later. Have a great day. Here is my egg loaf batter, and I got the Holsteins out today. Yep. Tastes like French toast. So, uh... Now I'm not making I'm not going to do all of the batter today. I'm going to save some and then tomorrow I'm going to try something different. <laughs> I'm just experimenting. So, but this is really good. Um I also did 3 of them with uh chihuahua cheese on them. Um so I'll I'll probably try those tomorrow, but yum. I think my sister would be proud that I'm eating sardines. <laughs> Look, Shanna, I'm eating sardines, and I'm actually liking them. I, I've got lemon juice in there and mustard, and um, it's supposed to have black olives in it, but it doesn't have very many. I think I might have to uh, buy some sliced olives just to add to these because I, I really like the olives. So, anyway, that's my lunch. Well, it's warm enough for me to sit out in the backyard. Got one of the cats keeping me company. The other orange cat is behind me in the little tent. Not sure where the other cats are. They're around here somewhere. Where are you going, kitty? Oh, need a drink, huh? Nope, maybe not. <laughs> so pretty. Hey there, it is time to close this day out. Um, remember, tomorrow is my birthday, and it is the last day for the giveaway. Um, I will link the uh, the YouTube video that you can go to to uh, get into the giveaway. Um, so I'm 
probably going to be drawing at 7 o'clock. It won't be live, like I said in yesterday's video. Uh, but it won't be long after that where I'll release the video for the giveaway winner. Um, so, if you could give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, I would really appreciate that. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye.